Never in my life would I ever have expected a character like Walter that I remember in episode 1 of being like a barbaric, like, brute. To have this amazing characterization, pretty much his character arc is over in the span of like 2 episodes is phenomenal. The savage brute Walter was actually a softy inside and felt bad and saddened because all his teammates have gone and can't really handle the brutal nature that is kind of adventuring. It's, it's, it's amazing. Like this show so far, that this, it felt like the prologue, felt amazing. Noel is like this true proponent of gender equality. <laughs> equal rights means equal less for women and men alike. What else was there? Um, the Dio voice actor guy, another zesty dude, right? Of course, he's basically that guy, the zesty dude or like Demon Lord type, right? I love how his whole voice acting is all fun and clown and playful when things are going right. And the more Noel like pushes and pushes for a bad deal, his voice he goes from, oh yeah, oh yeah, to hey, 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 stop it. That's pretty funny too. The world is seemingly expanding. We're going to make our own clan, and I know that we're going to get new teammates based on the opening visuals, right? Let's begin today's reaction. Dark skin elf girl? Dark skin elf girl? Yeah. Basically, we have leftovers. That's the guy, he's kind of friendly with us. This is the guy that we just sent on a mission, right? He's kind of was like, well, I wonder what he's been doing because we found them, right? Like, he was really not needed. He just went around chasing, chasing, and after, I guess he wasted a lot of time. You want to join? Oh, an invitation. Right. The guy back here looks like a fucking ninja from Naruto. I guess Lightning Bite is kind of trash. It's mid, and Noel's like, nah, y'all are not it. You're not the party mates that I'm wanting. Noel's not even a girl, but damn, she just compared him getting ditched by the flower girl compared to like Noel denying him here too. I mean, he can't get boys or girls. Alright. <laughs> hmm? Okay, why would you say that? Why would you say this? Hear that, you guys. I've got plenty of game with bros. What? <laughs> why, why, why are you saying it like this? I know it's just an invitation to the fucking clan, but like, yeah. I can bag both girls and dudes. He wants to be the clan leader. Everyone's down. Doesn't matter. That, that is the problem. He literally agrees. Subconsciously, he's like, yeah, you're right. He is smarter than me. Wait, wait, I'm still the leader. We'll do a rebrand. It's a girl, right? Jesus, that's an aggressive fucking cleavage. Heterochromia. Alma. She knows of us, too. Isn't it nice that anime girls are just 21? No long, no more 13 year olds safe. Noelle 16. Are yeah, we gonna invite her? Turn a tough guy into a damsel? What? It's, it's a book of... Strong, burly, rigid, tough guy turns into a damsel in distress. What the kind of... I'm kind of interested. That sounds hilarious. Like, Walter could be turned into a damsel? Mm, that's not very good. It's a good class, but like... C-Rank. For you, Noel. She's seeking him specifically, right? She knows the overdeath. Never mind. Is this revenge? Uh, the hero's grandson is a fucking 
He's a demon. <laughs> He's an abs. But then again, our Gramps is also called the fucking over death. I, I think that maybe he'd be proud of us. Yurikari. Is that supposed to mean something to me? Aldo Yurikari? Famous assassins? Okay. <laughs> How to turn a... What was it? Muscle head or something into a damsel? Maybe we should speak out. How's she gonna do it? Let's see it, Logan. Certain prestige, really. You gotta be important. To cream? What are, what is what are these words being used today? What the fuck? You gonna cream dudes? Did, did, did you break the rule? Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Under a boob, armpit. And the interesting design of the finger where the middle finger has no glove. That's a very interesting design. I don't know. I mean, you kind of look like a monkey right now. I don't know. I mean, the sharp teeth, it's kind of more like a shark teeth. I'm not sure, but that's you, bro. What's up, gorilla? Ooh. The combo. Aggressive cleave is aggressive. Boom. That's it. Easy. She can fight. She hungry. How cute. Alright, new party member game. Let's go. Fried bun. She's just been training in the boonies for a long time. How could you just believe that? He's a cunning man. Now they really hyping up Graham still, even though he's dead. That was no, no, no. The, the, the sword, the sword tattoo is important. That's what they're showing us. I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Wait, wait, what? Requirements. Is that a church? No, it's just more assassin people. Trial yeah, opponent. Ooh, Mr. Wolverine. Easy. Damn, she's fast. Jesus Christ, that cleavage. <laughs> Even more impressive. Oh, Jesus. Goodness gracious me. Good googly moogly. Dude, he caught that with fucking two fingers. <laughs> oh, of course, Simon. I remember you. Assassin Society leader, Simon Gregory. Wait, well, yeah, you tried to fucking kill him. The rules have changed. They're like, you're a fucking maniac. Get out of here. So she got kicked out of the Assassin Society. It's more about the personality. Government affiliated? W legit. Because they'll get in our way of our plans. We just got. She basically leaked the nuclear codes. This is supposed to be super, super important confidential material. She don't give a fuck, though. She didn't. 
Uh oh, hee hee. It's too late now, tee hee. Big si she is big sister. We're 16, she's 21, right? We're five years younger than her. Lucky guy. Not much. Yeah, you say shit and you buff her up. Yeah, you need to pick the right buff. He's really glazing his own role right now about how important and hard it is. Multitasking, managing resources. Man, we should have two talkers. There should be two talkers, man. If a talker by, by themselves can't buff themselves, we should have two talkers that's buffing each other at the same time. You know what I mean? Monster? Monsters is not the same as a beast. No! Looks like a cute rabbit. Loki looks like Rezero Bunny.見た目に騙されると串刺しにされるぞ。捕まえるのは実験のためだ。あの、バフをかけた状態で it's the same thing for the buffs, right? Yeah, the whole talk is about how if he buffs her too much and she doesn't know how to calibrate to her new powers, the vessel won't, you know, adapt enough and it'll break. Please ace the test. I know she's gonna ace the test. She and the other red haired samurai guy are like the two party members. But if she doesn't do well and she gets cut out, no, we can't. She's too good. This is the trailer thumbnail. I remember using this almost for my like trailer reaction like three months ago. Dude, her outfit's so ridiculous. <laughs> Welling up inside. Okay. Okay. Six times. Cool. The running animation is pretty good, huh? I mean, I'm not watching this show necessarily for the action scenes, but like they could have definitely fucked up this running animation, right? They could have had some weird as wonky sliding, gliding right around. This felt like she's actually running. Very smooth. Hi, hi. That animation was fantastic. Guys, comparing this to Blue Lock and Tower of God is not a comparison. Anything is better in Tower of God and Blue Lock at this point. Okay, it's, 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 it's just it's just a fact. New record! Hmm. Oh. A band of thieves, it can't be. Feels like an MMO quest we're accepting. That's so cute. What the fuck? A tiny mouse drives his carriage? You better skip this shit. I don't want to wait the entire episode to get there. Alright. 
アビスにモンスターを退治するモンスターハンターモンスターズビースト犯罪者を追跡捕獲するクライムトレジャーハンターハンティングエブリティング秘境の地を冒険するミスティックハントなどがある問題は本来土地を治める漁師の仕事だだが連中は動き滅びてしまうそこで俺たちシーカーに依頼が来るって仕組みだ貧しい農民だ報酬は期待できないが腕試しにはちょうどいいだろう退治するいいと思う so, so far there's like monsters right there's like monsters and then there's beasts and then there's something else. I forget exactly right but monsters Are like outside stuff, beasts are inside the dungeon stuff, and then there's a bunch of random stuff happening. Okay, one second. I have an internet issue right now. Hey, we're back! Easy! It's not too yeah, I was like, why is there a spinning wheel in my Twitch cons? Did I get fans? <laughs> Did I get fucking banned again? <laughs> muted? Uh, I'm not muted. You're muted. I'm not muted. You're muted. Everyone's laughing. They heard what I said. Fuck you. But I, I, I was like, oh shit. Did, 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 did I? <laughs> Anyways, okay, okay, okay. We're in the middle of a reaction. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Everything is good. We're back. We're gonna finish off the talker anime. Then we're gonna watch another thing as well. Let's rewind a couple back. I don't know. I don't know what happened. Let's 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 go back here, okay? Let's go back here and start from this point onwards. Let's go. Tansaksha. Seeker no shigoto wa taki ni wataru. Okay. Abyss ni hatsuge ta o taiji suru monster hunt. That's right. Monsters are outside. 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 And then they pay us the seekers. We're like mercenaries. I'm sorry. Oh, our old shitty party. Fuck you too. I like Walter though. Walter the goat. Walter the goat. These two. You gambling addicts. Surely it should be easy, right? We're not getting baited, right? <laughs> He did say your ass is gonna turn to stone. I think they could have made this a lot more curvier. This feels kind of weird. The ass here is too pointy. They could have done the booty cheek fan service more justice here. What? What do you want me to do, buddy? You wanna sit on my lap? That's a crazy hair. You're basically bald. Your hairline is starting from back here. Then it coils around. That's crazy. That's absolutely wild. Oh. No? Actually bald. <laughs> One bed. Wow. Loki just looks like a love hotel. I don't know. The pink fucking floor. One bed together with the curtains like that. Yo, this might as well be a fucking love hotel. Mm. What? We should both take it. Why not? He's a 16-year-old boy. 21, 16, 10, 15. But in the villainous show, that's the girl that's actually grooming the guy, even if he's 10, because she's actually like, probably like minimum like 20, maybe not 20, maybe even she's 15, you add the 10, she's still 25. Anyways, where are we going with this? <laughs> I would smash Big Sister too. I'm gonna tease him. Oh my goodness, that stretch. Oh, he's. He's pretty fit, yeah. God damn. So, those are pretty good, yeah. Great muscle. Yeah? You wanna sleep in the same bed? <laughs> With the nice muscles. Okay, we're not doing fan service. 
right? I, I thought it's too bad that you're not sleeping in bed with me. No, no, no. We're getting serious again. Is that Noel, you know, even if he trains his... Well, that's why he has to train. Even if he's never going to be a frontline fighter, he needs to have some base level competency, right? Because he can't fucking fight. <laughs> She's saying the quiet part out loud. Damn. That's fucked up. I'm sure Noah has some complex about that for being like the grandson of the, the overlord, the over dead, but he got a quote unquote shitty talk. But it's not shitty though. I don't think it is. I think the potential is even higher. If he's with the right teammates, I bet that they can reach heights that over death wasn't able to reach. Hmm? Oh. I don't know why I thought he'd take off his pants there. I, I, I don't know. I thought he'd take off his pants and say, look at my dong. Yes. It's gigantic. I'm a giga chat. Fuck you. And then goes to bed. I, I don't know. All right. Good night. Is he thinking about it? Yeah, he's thinking about it. Don't you think he regrets? Of course he does. He was so sad in the beginning. That hit a little bit too deep, man. That's like soul piercing. This is episode one. This is how we felt. Yes, he does. He's got longer eyelashes than most girls in this show. Yes, he does. Yeah? Okay, Gramps. Is Gramps just making us feel better? Or are we coping? And that's another episode of the Talker. In today's episode, introduction of new character. Who is she? She's hot. She's strong. She's fast. Clan of Assassins. Granddaughter of... A formidable grandfather who was also just like this legendary person. Head of the assassins like group, right? And our grandfather and her grandfather were quote unquote beefing. We cut his right hand arm off, but they harbor no grudge. In fact, she's kind of here to just like see what is the grandson of this legendary beast really like. And now she's figuring it out for herself. She's five years older than us. Nice to have a full fucking adult that we can thirst for rather than having weird, ambiguous, you know, young looking girls that could be suspicious land. But goddamn, the fan service for today was pretty damn good. And just when I thought they were gonna go beyond with the fan service, she hits us with just a, a cold, a piercing line. It's just like, yeah, sucks for you, huh? Also, this is a crazy frame right here. She says, sucks for you, huh? You got all of this muscles, but like, you ain't ever gonna be shit in the front lines because you're just a fucking yapper. And he knows that the best. But even if that's the case, I think due to this like inferiority complex that he may have and trying to, that, that makes him work harder than other people, that makes him be more sinister and cunning and do cold calculated decisions that we saw in episode two. And we probably will scale higher if we have the right teammates, right? Maybe we'll be able to reach a stage that even Gramps wasn't able to do. Well, that's it from me. If you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And I'll tell you next time. Take care.